What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Last Wraps Baseball card break. And today, uh, we're going to break something I've never seen before. And that is is uh, something from the championship collection. And uh, you've got one plush. I assume that that's got to be the plush. One hobby pack, six factory sealed packs, three bonus items, six cards, including one autograph or relic card in this big, huge box. And as you can see, here's my pen. And my pen is uh, obviously uh, not, uh, not that big, but it's just absolutely massive. And um, I have no idea what we're going to get. I really don't know what to expect, but it's one of these championship collection uh, type um, products. And as you can see, they got the uh, purple cards on the back. Looks like we got a Blue Jay. Looks like we have a, a Joey Bats on the side. Uh, this is a Canadian product. And so, uh, again, I don't know what we're uh, going to get out of this, but I thought it was kind of cool to pick it up and uh, share it. And maybe some of our American friends might get a kick out of some of this stuff uh, that's up here. So what are we looking at on the cost? These things, if you're lucky enough, can be found in Walmart. And you're looking at about $31 plus the tax. So let's say under $35 for one of these things. And as I say, I've never, I've never seen anything quite like this before. Now, the, the unfortunate part is I hear some things rattling around inside. So that's never a good thing. But um, let's, see what, uh, let's see what this is going to bring us. So if I'm going to uh, flip her around, here's our, uh, here's our opening for the box. Kind of a nice box. The packaging's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'm, I don't know what we're going to get. So here we go. Let's pop her down this way and uh, you're going to see what we're going to get uh, like everything else. Well, it looks like we got 2015 top sticker collection. We got something there. I've got a pack of pinnacle. That's the hobby pack. That's not too exciting. Uh, what else do I've got? Well, I got this, huh? That's kind of neat. I got this, uh, look at the size of this thing. It's a Joey Bats. It's like a, it's a Jose Bautista. It's like a, almost like a, I don't know what it is, but it's a, it's a plush figure. It's a bleacher creature. And there he is, Joey Bats, number 19. And so you, it's, it's, it's not a bobblehead, but it, it sort of looks like it could be a bobblehead. It's almost like a little doll. Anyways, there's Joey Bats. I got him. What else do I got? I got in here. Let's go back to that. We got, uh, I got a bunch of packs of cards. I got some other stuff. There we go. Okay, everything is out. So let's see what I have here. Huh. Looks like we got ourselves a couple of fat heads. So five by seven, move and peel uh, MLB sticker vinyl grips. And I, I don't know if you know the fat heads or not, but I don't know what players they are, so I haven't seen those in a while. Those were big in 2013, so a couple of fat heads. We got ourselves that sticker collection, and I'm just going to make a little adjustment with our uh, camera here so we can kind of get everything into focus before we get going any further. I've got a, um, I got a pack of 2019 Series 1 Baseball. That seems to be popular these days. And we got another pack of 2019 one Series Baseball. We got a pack of 2018 Topps Chrome, Shohei Otane. So that's not bad. I got another pack of 2019 Series 1 Baseball. I've got a pack of, again, 2018 Chrome. And then I got 2017 holiday pack. So, so I, we're obviously looking for an Aaron Judge in there. We had the hobby pack that we saw of the Pinnacle. What year is this Pinnacle one here? Does it tell us on the Panini on the back side? Uh, we'll, we'll take a peek at it. And then I've got, uh, I got it off camera here, but we, they gave us, a, um, they gave us a, a box of about six cards. And so I'm just going to hold that back over here. I'm not even going to open the sticker collection. Nah, I don't care what we get. I, I haven't done anything much with stickers. So, all right, let's see what uh, let's see what we're able to come up with out of this thing. I'll even pop open the fat heads too uh, because I want to see it. So, if I had to give a break on uh, what I'm going to open, I'm going to do the 2019 series one first. Then I'll do the hobby pack. I'll do the holiday pack. I'm going to do the last one. I'm going to do is the chrome. So this is what we got. Let me know if you think it was worth the thirty dollars Canadian value, which is approximately twenty four or twenty five bucks. 
U.S. Series 1 baseball started to come around lately. Um, obviously, we got uh, Ramon Laureano. We got a few rookies in this set. So let's see what we have. We got Mitch Moreland. We got Mark Trumbo. got Shoei Otane. I got Nick Castellanos. I got Francisco Cervelli. Kyle Baraclough. I saw him pitch in Seattle one year. He gave up uh, a hit that broke up a no, that, that lost a no hitter for the Marlins. Uh, Kirby Yates, Brad Peacock, Orlando Arcia, uh, Sonny Gray with the Yankees. I don't remember seeing that card before, and that's not saying much. Um, Mitch Moreland was our lead guy. So that pack was absolutely useless. All right, that's pack number one and done out of the way. I wonder what's in this pack. It's got a kind of a strange feel to it. So let's see if maybe we got something uh, in here that's uh, somewhat decent. Do we have anything fat in here? I don't think so. All right, so what do we get in this pack? Well, we got a Colby Allard rookie card. I got a Jock Peterson. I've got Michael Brantley. I got Xander Bogarts. Who do we have after Bogarts? Edwin Encarnacion, Chris Iannetta, Adam Eaton, and then I flip over. I've got Elvis Andrews. I got Joe, uh, Joe Jimenez. And I've got Jose Martinez, who uh, was a part of that trade to Tampa Bay. Uh, and then I've got the 2019 Tops Series 1 yet again. So let's see what we can come up with with this one. And see what we got. So, so far, right now, not a whole lot. So I've got Ray Black. And I got Jacob Nix. So we got a couple of rookies, which is a little more than the others. We got Kyle Schwarber. We got Joey Lucchese, uh Future Star card. We have the Philadelphia Phillies. Christian Yelich. We got American League West studs. So there's Otani and Bregman. I've got a uh, flip these over. I got Danny Duffy of the Royals, Jake Odorizzi, and Jack Flaherty of the Cardinals. So. Uh, was it a disappointment? I don't know if it's a disappointment or pretty much to be expected. Uh, let's do the hobby pack next. The hobby pack is Pinnacle. Uh, I'm guessing that's got to be about 2015 or 2016. I'll look on the back and we'll we'll be able to find out in a couple minutes. I don't know what's uh, what's in the Pinnacle packs from Panini, but it looks like Panini is going to give us a hard time in opening it. And there's Drupal Cabrera on the back side. So what do we have here? We've got uh, we got a Hanley Ramirez. And this is, it looks like, uh, what year are we looking at here? Uh, 2013. We've got a Michael Young. I got myself a Dylan Bundy rookie card. Uh, we've got a Chris Russon rookie card. I don't know who he is. I don't know who Bundy is. I've got a Bryce Harper, Team 2020. Well, that, that's a good prediction. Uh, because he probably would be a Team 2020 type guy. Hunter Pence, who's recently retired. Justin Verlander. And then there's that as Drupal Cabrera. So, so far, four packs and uh, nothing worth getting excited about. What am I looking for here in this uh, holiday pack? Well, definitely looking for Aaron Judge. I'll definitely have to take a Judge anytime soon, 2017. I've got Starling Marte. We've got Michael Fulmer of the Tigers. I've got Marco Estrada of the Blue Jays. We've got a Nolan Arenado. Um, I got Kevin Kiermeyer for the Tampa Bay Rays. I got a Nomar Mazzara. This is a parallel. This is the Snowflake one. So there's Nomar Mazzara in the Snowflake parallel. I've got Hanley Ramirez. I've got Eric Skoglund or Skogland, a rookie card. I got Ryan Braun, Evan Longoria, and we're back to the top on Starling Marte. So, so far, five packs and uh, five packs that if I never had to see them again, I'd be okay with that. So here comes the 2018 Topps Chrome. So Topps Chrome, well, let's see what Topps Chrome has to, to offer today. So I've got Daniel Murphy. That's a nice looking card. It's too bad it's Daniel Murphy. I got Chris Taylor, who's currently in the World Series for the uh, for the the Dodgers. Had himself a home run the other night. I got Evan Longoria, and the last one is Justin Bohr. So Justin Bohr, who's now applying his trade with the Hanshin Tigers in Japan. So pack number one down. Nothing really to get excited about. Here comes our second pack. And our second pack is we've got a Scott Kingery rookie card, Scott Kingery of the Phillies. 
And then I've got an insert. I got a DD Gregorius uh, 19, what's that, 83 style insert. I've got Michael Fulmer and I've got Paul DeYoung. So yeah, I got Kingery and Gregorius. Not bad, nothing too spectacular. Uh, let's go to our fat heads. Let's see what we have in the fat head department. So. I've not uh, not really got into this, but I'm kind of curious just to see. They gave us two fat heads. They told us there'd be some extra stuff here. And so who would be the player that we would get in the fat head? Well, we're going to find out right about now. And it looks like we got ourselves, well, there's Yoenis Cespedes. And what's on the back? Fat head 2013 tradables. These things are huge. I got an Adrian Beltre. I've got myself an Andre Ethier. There's Joey Botts. We got a Jose Bautista card. I got a Hunter Pence. And uh, you can save now. If anybody wants this code, if it's even worth it anymore, I don't even think it's it's available. Feel free to go ahead to fathead.com, take my code and enter it in because we won't be doing it. Bring on the ballpark action. It looks like uh, St. Louis there. And so those are the fatheads. That's what they look like. And uh, that's what we were able to get. So 2013 Fatheads. If there are any Fatheads here that are worthwhile, I don't know, probably the Joey Bots to get some people excited and, uh, and whatever else. Well, let's take a look at the other Fathead and see what we have here. I guess you can cut them off and put them on your lockers, on your walls. Fathead number... You know what? Forget it. I'm not even going to open that Fathead one. Nah, I'm not even going to open it. I uh, We've never done much with the Fatheads and... I'm more interested in the other stuff. Stickers, forget it. What do we have here? Well, we got a autograph card. We have an Alexi Casilla autograph, rookie Minnesota Twins. And these must be these extra cards that have. So I'm glad I got an autograph as opposed to a relic card. And now what else did we get? Well, we got an opening day Cavan Biggio card. And for those of you stateside, I don't know if you've seen the Canadian stuff. We got a Vladdy Guerrero. Vladdy Guerrero. That's kind of cool. There's the Bobichet. I know that um, my friend the hobbyist would probably uh, appreciate that one. We've got Randall Grichik. And then we got Lourdes Gurriel. And we're back to Minnesota Twins. So we got all these Blue Jays. And then in the mix here, we got a certified tops autograph of Alexi Casilla. And, um, and, and that's what we, we, we ended up getting. So, I don't know, for $31, was it worth it? I don't know, maybe it was worth it for this thing, for Joey Bats. But, uh, I don't know, I'm not sure. Anyways, well listen everybody, now you've had the opportunity to take a look at that championship collection, see what we're able to get. I didn't see a graded card in there, nothing this time. Uh, let me know what you think. If you think you'd spend 31 Canadian plus the tax, or 23 US, let me know what, what you think of this product review, and... And we can uh, have some discussion in the comment section. Once again, everybody, thanks again for uh, watching another Last Raps Baseball video production. We hope you have a great day. And come on back and see us again later. We got some more cool stuff coming up.